Rock for Love 5, the annual church health center benefit show. It kicks off today. 25 bands, or 24 rather, are expected to play over the next few days, give or take. Marvin Stockwell from the church center, health center, and Julia McDonald from Arts Memphis, a fundraising organization for the arts, are both here to talk about the event. Um, so 24, 25 bands, 24, I guess. 25. It, it's a lot. It's, it's, it really all depends. <laughs> yeah. Somebody's playing twice, so do you count them twice? I don't know. I don't know. It's a lot. It's a lot. <laughs> and um, I like your t-shirt. Yeah, yeah. Five, so our are they going to be available at they the will concerts? Be. The, the okay. t-shirts will be available, and of course, all the funds raised from that, as with everything else, go to benefit the work of the Church Health Center. I love it. It's like a vintage t-shirt already. Yeah, our it friend looks. Sasha Barr designed it, and, and uh, he's been our voluntary volunteer art uh, designer all five years. All right, so Marvin, while I have you, know, let's start off with you first. Sure. Uh, th this is your fifth year. Fifth year of Rock for Love, right? And huge thing, and I know you can't announce all the bands but sure. tell me a little bit about uh, what people can expect this right year. if you know if a person were had just moved to Memphis and they wanted to get a crash course in what is so great about the Memphis music scene they could just really just tie one on and go for the whole weekend <laughs> and really get a great cross-section of great Memphis music uh, everything from uh, bake sale to the bow keys from from the established uh, to the kind of like uh, burgeoning new talent right. and, uh, some quiet some louder I mean it's just really it's an eclectic mix that uh, that, sh that showcases the the variety of, of Memphis music. Um, I'm uh, blessed to be part of a very generous Memphis music scene. My band Pez is playing on the Friday night. Nice. Uh, my planning cohorts, J.D. Rieger and Jeff Hewlett, their bands uh, are playing the Near Reaches and Glory. Uh, so it's just um, it, there's something for everyone. Uh, most of the shows are at the high tone. The okay. night shows are at the high tone, but we also have an early evening show on Friday night at the gazebo near Goner Records in Cooper Young, mm -hmm. and then a day-long uh, uh, a day party, we're calling it a day party, uh, at Shangri-La Records with the Grizzlies Water Slide, free TCBY yogurt, nice. the Hooper Troopers out there giving uh, hooping lessons, it'll be great. Ah, no, what time does that start? On Saturday, the day show is uh, goes from 1 to 5 at okay. Shangri-La on Madison. Oh, it's going to be busy down there, it's going to be great. It's going to be great. Yeah, and the weather's not going to be bad, so perfect. Okay, so Julia, uh, tell me a little bit about Arts Memphis. I know that you're backing um, this concert. We are um, we are partnering with the Church Health okay. Center this evening. Um, uh, Arts Memphis is a fundraising and grant-making organization for the arts, and all donors to Arts Memphis are members. Um, we have a membership level called Bravo that is the um, kind of more active, fun, engaged um, people in their 20s through 40s who uh -huh. get out. A membership is for 12 months and we go to a different arts event every month. Um, and we just have a great diverse lineup of events to go to. Things from, you know, the Dixon and the Brooks to um, going on artist studio visits, really getting to see different um, aspects of the artistic life of our city. So we're very excited to be going to the Rock for Love concert this evening at the High Tone. Um, Star and Micey, Grace Askew, DJ Lady Problems, among others, will be playing. So just a wonderful <laughs> way for, you know, DJ people. Lady Problems. I've heard of before, yeah. Yeah. People um, who are fun and, and, and want to be involved to, to, to do so. Now, Arts Memphis, very interesting. How much does that cost to become a member? It is $100 a person for 12 months of events, and that okay. is a guaranteed definite event each month. Plus, we have bonus events, restaurant visits, special offers, different things for people all through the year. And, of course, you could really... You know, commute. I mean, you could just meet new people yes. doing that. Yes. And and that's awesome. And then when you say a hundred dollars, uh, is that that's not to get into the event? That is just strictly for no, it is the a membership, membership for only. a year. And so okay. each event then has no cost after okay. that. It's included in your membership price. So I know that it's quite overwhelming with all of these concerts going on, and I'm sure that you have them all listed. Under right. Your if you go to churchhealthcenter.org, they're mm -hmm. all listed there. But it's basically 24 bands, 25 bands playing six uh, shows over four. Days. Days, something for everyone and it all benefits uh, the Church Health Center. And that Saturday event sounds super duper cool. Uh, and yeah, is this one of your biggest fundraisers? It has grown to become so. Yeah, yeah we, it, it's grown from a, a one evening event in 2007 to this kind of larger, people are starting to call it a festival yeah. now. And I guess <laughs> I guess it has grown to the festival uh, level. But uh, yeah, and it just, it has grown to, we've raised, uh, going into this year, we'd raised $92,000. Uh, for the Church Health Center, uh, and we've raised about 21500 so far in monetary sponsorships this year uh, before we sell ticket one. Now, when you put that into context, the Church Health Center is a $13 million annual charity, 
still a drop in the bucket, but it does go to provide a lot of care for a lot of people. Sure does. Thank you both for being here. Thank sure you so much. It's going to be a great turnout. And then for more information about the Rock for Love 5 concert, including the musical lineup, we do have a link to their website with ours, abc24.com. Just click on the right side of our homepage.